The air was charged with excitement and apprehension as both candidates and supporters nervously waited for USAC election result. Members and supporters for Bruins United and Students First flooded the Kirkhoff steps late into the night in anticipation. Finally, at around 10 p.m., election board chair Kyle Kleckner stepped in front of the crowd to reveal next year's Your slate. next presidents of the Undergraduate Students Association Council is Hamira President-elect Hamira Husseini will lead a slate dominated by other Students First candidates, along with two Bruins United general representatives and some independents. I think um, if all the um, members involved in USAC currently, be it in appointments um, or committees or whatnot, if their real intention is to serve the student body, then there will be not much um, of a problem. We can all work together. The rowdy Students First supporters sang songs and waved flags in celebration of their victory, while Bruins United looked on in shock and disappointment. Tonight's results shift the slate majority next year from a predominantly Bruins United Council to one controlled by Students First. Significant campaign strategy changes may have contributed to this major switch. As far as tailoring the campaign really to, to win first before they went about and like talked about their platform, like they were out there to win. It was clear to see that from day one. Like just the little simple things, changing their shirt color, like really trying to be the populist party, you know, which BU had traditionally sought out to be. We definitely um, wanted to make sure that um, students looked at our platforms the most, and we were able to engage in a dialogue with students about the platforms. With this in mind, Bruins United looks ahead with bittersweet optimism to next year's elections. Heard of a party called Students First, who last year won two seats on USAC, and then came back to great victory. Yeah, we're gonna have just like they did an entire year to plot, strategize, and come back even stronger than we did, because the ideas that founded this party don't die and they're not going to, and we'll be back with them even stronger than we've ever been next year. For more election coverage, go to www.dailybruin.com. For Daily Bruin Television, this is Paula B. Reddy.